What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. On the video today, I'm going to be sharing with you how to cut a textured fringe uh, just using a few simple steps. So the first step is take a triangle section right out of the front fringe area, go about three inches up to find your top point, and then draw a line straight down the hairline to create that triangle. Then you take a vertical section straight out of the center and pull it straight parallel to the wall, and then you make your first cut. You can see how soft that falls, uh, creating that kind of graduated feel to the fringe. You don't want to elevate too much because you don't want to layer your fringe. Uh, so then I'm just going to continue working through the same uh, partings, bring everything over to that center point. So we're working with a stationary guide to push weight over to that temple area. So we're just going to continue through and then I'll talk to you when we get to the other side. All right, so now I'm gonna take a little bit from my guideline to work my way into the left side of the head. Uh, so I'll just pull the rest over and then I use that guide. We're bringing everything out the same exact way that we did before. Body position stays exactly the same. Biggest difference is we're now pulling the hair towards our body, pulling it towards that center guideline and cutting through. We're gonna continue this all the way through the left side. All right, so you can see how that weight shifts within the haircut. We take off our Velcro clips. Those are brand new to uh, our online store, Shop FSE. If you're looking for some new tools, uh, check it out there. You can also get this diamond head ergo brush on there as well. And the scissors that you're seeing, everything that you see, you can get on Shop FSE. All right, so we're just gonna go through, blow dry, work the hair back and forth, trying not to put any kind of parting into the hair, a little bit of leafing to go through it, add a little bit of volume to the hair, uh, and just kind of smooth it out. And then we're gonna hit it with the iron uh, to just add a slight bevel to it. We're using the Dyson Corral iron uh, just to smooth it out and give it a little bit of bend. Now you can see we hit it with a little bit of spray. You can see the texture. See how light that fringe is. That's all because of that elevation. Now you could choose the length. You can go a little bit shorter. You can go a little bit longer, whatever you want to do. Uh, it's, it's up to you. But here is our end result. Hope you guys like it. Make sure you subscribe to us right here on YouTube and check out all the education we have to offer for free on freesaloneducation.com. Thanks for watching.